marriage is beautifully grounded in devotion and faithfulness. Romans 12 and 10 tells us to be devoted to one another in love, to honor one another above ourselves. To the space between the clouds There's something beautiful in the quiet we have found Two are better than one because they have a good return for their labor. Either of them falls down, one can help the other up. It can take us, heaven knows, the world that we will find will paint the open sky, illuminate the night, you and I. Absolutely no words to say how happy I am for you guys in this beautiful relationship you've already had. And thank you so much for letting me be a part of this beautiful story that you guys have and accepting me right away and my quirky self and the sense of humor click that we've just been able to have. It's been really wonderful. And in the mystery, there's reason for desire. Let love and faithfulness never leave you. Bind them around your neck. Write them on the tablet of your heart. Then you will win favor and a good name in the sight of God and man. Angela, I know that um, when we pictured our wedding and our unity that we didn't think that it would start right off in sickness um, as we were promising in sickness and in health but over these past couple of months you've been wonderful through all of it you've been a trooper every day I am more and more grateful for the grace that you give me for the grace that you give our daughter I'm so grateful to be standing with you here today. It's just another beautiful moment to stand here and say that I love you and I still do and I still choose you. To all of my friends and family who are here and also to the people who are not able to make it, I just thank you all for your love and for your support. Angela and Winston, tonight we celebrate you. We all wish you a lifetime of happiness, love, health, success, and laughter. May you continue to find humor in bad and appreciation for good. May your friendship continue to grow throughout all the years to come. Cheers.